Can you describe the way it fires up your team? First game of the season, first at bat, Aaron Judge steps up there and goes wow. to center field. <clears throat> I mean, that's about as tough a guy as you're going to do it against right on right. Webb, Webb's going to keep you in the ballpark. And t to get a ball up like that um, and to hit it out on a cold day, dead center, um, not only is it is a difficult chore in and of itself, but yeah, to, to get us a shot right there in the first and, um, you know, kind of let Garrett go take it from there. And then some good at bats later with JD getting on a, ahead of the, uh, the GT homer, getting that ball elevated was huge, but yeah, to set the tone for us like that, you know, especially after, you know, the off season and, you know, signing back and captain for him to kind of get us ro rolling was very fitting. Uh, Ron, right here. Brendan, over to the left. You had talked a number of times about your low point in the offseason, fearing he might wind up there. When he homers and circles the bases, do you kind of smile to yourself and say, what were you worried about? <laughs> um, no, I just, you know, more impressive that he just comes up and does it first A-B against that particular pitcher. Um that's where it's just like I just kind of said to him an inning later I said really and he just kind of smiled so uh more impressed with just the craft of it all Brendan two questions first how did you think that Anthony handled himself today I thought really well man you know I mean first a b's you know, gets the big walk, steals a base, you know, handled the routine plays in the field, turned a double play, had the right at bats, you know, even even the punch out there, um, you know, first and third, we were at another scoring opportunity. He's having the right at bat, you know, he's seeing the ball, he's not anxious. Um, I, I thought he was... I, I thought he was terrific. I thought he was really good. And, and what did you think of that first at bat, uh, going full count, working the? Yeah, work? I mean that's who he is, you know. And and to, it's, you know, it's another thing to do it opening day and with the team you grew up watching, and now you're the shortstop. Um, yeah, I mean you go up there and you, he's aggressive early, fouls the first pitch off, but the ability to take close pitches are are one of the things that's going to help him um, be the kind of player we think he is. Aaron, so much pomp and circumstance surrounds this day. Maybe weather aside, could you have written a better script for opening day? Um, no, that's pretty good. You know, when your ace goes out there and punches 11 and in six innings and the bullpen kind of, you know, and, and kind of everyone had a hand in it, you know. Um, you know, we were able to add on a couple of insurance runs with some good quality at bats there late with Trevi and, and DJ and... Um, getting involved and judgy fighting one off to dump one out there so good job of adding on there you know caught the ball on defense uh you know i thought trevi was great behind the plate as usual so just just crisp which you know you like to see on opening day which isn't all you know one of the big things early in the season is you, you just i just always want guys to get first out of the way and kind of get settled as quickly as possible um and i thought we looked like a settled team out there and that was good to see bill in the middle this is your fourth year with garrett what has impressed you the most about him and i guess he proved today that he's a horse um how much pride he takes in being that guy and how much he puts into 365 days a year being that guy and and all the prep and all the thought and all the care that goes into being prepared to take the ball every fifth day during the season and being that guy um you know it, it's a 365 day a year he plans it out of how to rest how to work how to prepare um you know he cares deeply about pitching he cares about his team he cares about this organization and that shows itself in different ways all year long but he 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 takes a lot of pride in taking the ball today and again in, it'll be six days this time but he takes a lot of pride in that laura
Obviously, last year we saw a judge block out a lot of the noise uh, surrounding him. But, you know, this year he has a heightened expectation of the captaincy and the new contract. Do you think a part of him actually thrives on something like that, on all that expectation on him? Probably. Probably. Look, he likes the stage. He likes, you know, I think he loves this organization and what it means. Um, he's, you know, the central figure within this organization now. Um, so I think he takes a lot of pride in that. Um, and I do think he thrives. Yeah, I think he loves the competition. He loves the big stage. He loves um, competing with and against the best in the world. And that's, I think, fun to him. And the more you can find fun in what you're doing, the more your talent in his ta case is going to come out. Tyler to the right. Aaron, how much, if at all, did you notice the pitch clock or the the uh, no shift or the base running stuff today? Um, not a lot, just because we've been doing it now for 40 days or whatever. So um, I've noticed it there. Now you're just in a big league stadium with a full house and you know and it counts so i guess you notice it a little bit um but i also feel like in a lot of ways i were used to it uh, back to the left aaron does an opening day victory feel a little more special than most other wins yeah yeah i think yeah i think winning on opening days um meaningful you know there's a lot that goes into this day we talked about before the game um what an exciting day and hope springs eternal today with every team um and this is the start of it for real so yeah i think it i think it maybe means a little more uh but you also realize pretty quickly that it's just one back middle last one Aaron, uh, one, you didn't have a good sprint, but you didn't hesitate to go to him right after Cole. What did you see from him out there? And how important it is for you guys that he has a good year at this? Yeah, I mean, Wandy's one of our dudes, you know, so he didn't have a good spring. He's thrown the ball fine, like all spring, too. You know, he's working on some things. Um, so I wasn't at all hesitant to go to him, uh, especially, you know, in this that lineup with their lefties and you know knowing they're gonna obviously shoot some um some pinch hitters against them but um no he's one of our guys and and his results this spring didn't temper that at all like you know i'd be concerned if i didn't feel like he was where he needed to be or throwing the ball the way he needed to he was you know he made some mistakes and gave up some homers on some things he was working on but um and he's another guy you know we talk about he loves the competition. The the bigger, the better. You know, the bigger the moment, the better. He, he loves that stage. So no hesitation to give him the ball today.